What's up guys? My name is Mad Squash 924 Welcome back to another episode of Assassin's Creed 3, Part 19. Um, I think we're here in Brazil. I think that's where we are. I might be wrong, but we're looking for the next power source. That's that much is certain. Um, hopefully we can find what we need here. I mean, ordinarily, I probably would have done some off-camera things, like trying to find chests feathers, what have you, in New York. But since um, we're not in New York and and we're not Connor, I couldn't really do that, could I? Yeah, we're in Brazil. I could tell by the flag. You copy now? Loud and clear. What's the plan? Hmm. According to our intel, the power source is being worn as a bracelet by some tycoon's trophy wife. We're working on pinpointing her location, but she's most likely inside a VIP booth on the stadium's upper level. I'll update you when I know more. Now to find a ticket. We don't have time to play nice. Steal someone else's. Bit of a dick move, don't you think? Who cares? Well, I guess you could try and sneak past security instead. Preciso ver seu bilhete. Preciso ver seu bilhete. Pode entrar. So I can try to sneak or I can steal a ticket. I'm going to steal a ticket. Never mind. No, I can't. I would have otherwise. Let's go this way. That doesn't look like normal security. What do you mean? Those are Abstergo agents. Cross is probably here too. You need to be careful. Do I not have like a hidden blade? Maybe not. Little late now, don't you think? Hmm. Not good. This is a weird loading screen. Oh, really? I gotta be way back here again? That doesn't look like normal security. Because it isn't. Because it's not. So he's looking that way, you're looking that way, you're coming back this way, you're still over there because you're a silly little man, and I'm going to go this way. Fuck it. What are they going to do? Find me? Oh shit. Oh shit. Hmm. Fuck. Great. You've set up a checkpoint. There's so many dudes. Ow. <laughs> Son of a bitch. So what am I supposed to do about that? Also, that was some bad timing anyways, because like I went in the room and they immediately saw me because they just happened to be there. Not idealistic. Freaking sucks. Can I not like that climb anything? Like normal security. Didn't realize there was a door over here. Your okay. Well, at least we're in. Do I go this way? No. Yeah, it would. Hide, hide. Great. I've set up a checkpoint. Don't go in the bathroom, quick. <laughs> Shit. This bit's a little rough. And and uh, I might be getting slightly impatient. Just a little. Oh, 
Okay, let's try this shit again, huh? That doesn't look like normal security. Because it isn't. Those are absurd. Yeah, 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 yeah. Alright, right, let's just go to the restroom. Your target's definitely in the VIP area. The entrance is at the end of this concourse. Okay, go agents. Don't let them Chame see you. Hide. Hide. I'm just gonna run for it, you know? Motherfucker. Great. They've Look set out. up a ch Great. They're gonna punch me. What a start to an episode, huh? Can't be stealthy because, well, Desmond's wearing a white hoodie in the middle of this place where nobody else is wearing a white hoodie. That doesn't look like normal security. Because it isn't. Those are agents. Like Agent Smith agents. Your target's definitely in the VIP area. The entrance is at the end of this I can't blend in with, like, crowds either, and that's a problem. That's kind of a freaking big issue. Just saying. Man, those guys are circling back. Yeah, thanks. Even though they're kind of looking in this vicinity. Don't you look this way, you little freakazoids. Shit house? They've set up a checkpoint. Do 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 just gotta go poop. Okay, we're in. Seriously, what is the deal with stadiums and piss troughs? It's disgusting. And who thought they were a good idea? Troughs are time and cost efficient. I don't even see a stall in here. Uh, what if I have to take a dump? Yeah, please just mute the microphone if you do. Well, we finally got past that bit, which is good because that bit was annoying. Looks like I'm close. Shit. Another checkpoint. You're gonna have to find another way around. Security's too tight. Okay then. Watch your back, they're on here. No, they're not. They don't know nothing. And we're in. Almost that weren't too bad. Just on the other side of the stadium. Other side? Ah, oh, there's another guard. We're trying fast walking a little bit, because, um, I don't want to be running. Shit. Fuck, I can get past that asshole. That works. Cat box. And nobody notices what we're doing. You're really close now. The power source should be in one of the rooms up here. Yeah, that's great. Which one? Not sure. Must be this way, right? It's the opposite side. Hmm. Here we are. Holy shit. Let's 
cross. Hey. He has the power source. We freaking start. Okay, we're almost there. Getting shot at. That's great. Gonna beat all their asses now. Ow, fucker. There we go. Now give me my shit. To the right. Get out of my way, asshole. Well, we did it. We can get back to Connor whenever you're ready, Desmond. Unless you want to plug in the power source first. Up to you. Yeah, we probably should. Now, the power source plug-in was this way. If I remember right. We should probably plug it in first. Once we do, we'll go back to being Desmond. Did I say Desmond? I meant Connor. There she is. That's where we're going. That's where we gotta go. That's how we do. Hmm. I gone the wrong way. It's hard to tell. This place is freaking dark. Like absurdly dark. Let's go this way. I'm trying to find myself a route. To get where she's at. Unless I just run over here. But... It's not as simple as that. Hmm. How the shit does one get in there? I did see like a little crack over here, but I don't think our fat ass can get through that crack. These cracks. 
Nope. We should be able to, theoretically, but... Nope, he's too fat. So what the hell am I missing? <sighs> Shit, I fell like all the way down. Let's one get to where she is. Through here? Hard, maybe. Yeah, maybe. Yep. Power. Tell me today. I'm telling you, there's something down here. Don't be daft. I don't know, maybe they were sleeping or something and we woke them. Some kind of cryogenics or hibernation. I mean, the shit are you talking about? What the hell they were doing down here? They were working on a bunch of different solutions, but nothing worked. Just went from one to the next and then I don't know. They must have left at some point after the end. I wonder what the world would be like if they'd succeeded. I'm more concerned about what it'll be like if we don't. Salvation. They found a way. Too late for them, but not for you. Sealed to protect it. Though now it bars your way. Find the key. The past will tell. Okay. So the next entrance is right here. Let's see what Juno has to say. Then we just kind of follow it, I suppose. Oh yeah, this way. A new world approached. One that was dark and cold. It would consume us, for we were flesh, and flesh is frail. Though suits and shields might offer comfort, such adornments would not suffice, not to save us all. So we sought to change what we were. In this manner, we might thrive in a world made poisonous. It was Aita who volunteered to see if it might be done. Aita, my husband, my love. In the end, it changed him, ruined him. He was made a prisoner of the machines. The body might survive, but his mind became brittle to the touch. He begged me for release, for days, for weeks, for months. I pleaded with him to give us time to find another way. But, but there, there wasn't, wasn't one. one. Not, Not for, for him. him. Not, Not for us. us. It's pretty brutal. Yeah, let's just get down and progress then. Back to being Connor. Oh, look at that. 
I found a third power source. Really? Already. It popped up in an earlier search, but I've only just managed to confirm it. Where? There's a museum in Cairo with one on display. I guess Connor will have to wait. No, you stay. We need to find that key, and time is running out. I'll make the trip. What about Cross? Everything's going to be fine. I'll be back soon. Ready when you are, Desmond. Okay. Winter approaches. The air is still and sharp with grim expectation. The others sense it too and go about their work with uncommon urgency. I would like to help them, but more pressing matters now demand my attention. The Templars have targeted George Washington directly and will not rest until he is dead. I had hoped to shield him from this knowledge, but Thomas Hickey ended any hope I had of staying silent. And so I have resolved to share everything I know of the Templars and their plots, of who I really am. Achilles finds fault in this, and we argue every day, but there is simply too much now at stake to make Davenport Homestead, strength. 1777. Sequence 9. Don't do this, Connor! Then what would you propose we do? Sit and watch while the Templars take control? We are sworn to stop them, or have you forgotten? Assassins are meant to be quiet, precise. We do not go announcing conspiracies from the rooftops to all who pass by. Who are you to lecture anyone? You locked yourself away in this crumbling heap and gave up on the Brotherhood entirely. Since the day I arrived, you've done nothing but discourage me. And on the rare occasions you've chosen to help, you've done so little, you may as well have done nothing at all. How dare you? <laughs> then tell me, on whose watch did the Brotherhood falter? Whose inaction allowed the Templar Order to grow so large that it now controls an entire nation? If I sought to dissuade you, it was because you knew nothing. If I was reluctant to contribute, it was because you were naive. A thousand times you would have died and taken God knows how many with you. Let me tell you something, Connor. Life is not a fairy tale, and there are no happy endings. No. Not when men like you are left in charge. In your haste to save the world, boy, take care you don't destroy it. Ha! <laughs> They've been fighting. Okay, where the hell are we? Oh, we're back out here. Gotcha. What's this? A harbor master. Our main quest is to go that way. I kind of want to go back to the homestead. To see if there's any new homestead missions. We shall see about our assassins. Um, Yeah, go back to Massachusetts and finish what you were doing. Cool. Yes, there is another homestead mission. Good. Let's do that. I should probably get out of this suit pretty soon. I've been wearing this suit for a few episodes. I just haven't had the chance and opportunity to change out of it. Especially with the sequence when we were in prison, so we couldn't even do anything about it then. But now we can. Let's talk to Big Dave. See what missions he has for us. Connor, you uh, have a minute, my friend? Yep. The proper tools. Is it coming, Big Dave? You make any progress on the knife? I would like to give it to Miriam soon. The steel Norris smelted is something else. I've rarely seen such fine metal. The trouble is my old tools aren't hard enough to work it. 
But the ones I need aren't hard to find. A shop or two in New York sell them at a good price. I'd do it myself, but with the regulars after my head, I'll stay here safe and sound if I can. I have matters to attend to in New York. I will see to it the next time I journey there. Sounds good. So we gotta go to New York then. Should be simple. Okay, it is... Holy shit, there's a lot to do here. Well, let's do this one. The one that's closest. There's a ton to do here. Um, what can we purchase here? Citizen mission items. The ebony hammer handle. We need that. Hardened steel hammerhead. There we go. Cool. Those are done. Might as well pick up a new outfit. The New York outfit. We can wear that for the rest of this episode and the next. It's new firearms and heavy weaponry. Naval axe. Officer sword. And... Oh, is there maps too? Well, I'm not going to click on the outfits. Um, double barrel pistol. Can't afford it currently. Later on, we can. Um, map wise... We have them all. Okay. Let's go return to Big Dave about these tools. And then, um, I think that'd be an episode. What's his name? Big man or some such thing? Big Dave. Did in a whole unit escaping, they say. Dave's in for a rough ride, seems to me. Okay, that's not good. Go back to Davenport Homestead. Okay, and it's just over here. But um, I do think this is actually a good spot for us to end today's episode of Assassin's Creed 3. Hope you guys all enjoyed. If you guys have, make sure you guys leave a like, leave a comment. Tell me what you think of today's episode, of course. And if you're new to my channel where I've been watching me for a little while and you haven't done so, feel free to subscribe to me, Mad Squash 924 and do not forget to ring the bell to get notified of my latest videos. On the next episode, we're going to go do the next homestead mission. And we'll do the next um, few homestead missions since now they are available to us. Probably go off camera a bit as well, um, if I have time, and see about collecting some chests and other such things. But I'll see you then. Goodbye.